we are not trying to fool you that this is of any historical value. Purely and simply, it's scrap. But scrap is the delight of Jess Watkins. Jess is an artist, an artist who survived the inartistic ways of the naval life his father insisted he should follow. After being torpedoed at the age of 14, he became one of the youngest master mariners in the mercantile marine. But all the while he dreamed of art, of creating. All his leaves were spent in art school, and now that Jess is over 60, his dream has come true in a way he possibly never visualized. For the medium through which he expresses himself is scrap metal. He explains, once I find a satisfactory piece of metal, I look for another with an affinity to it. He works on the metal to get harmony, as though it was a piece of music. Jess works up to 50 hours a week and so far has created 20 pieces. But he can't start without inspiration. His metal sculpture can take him anything up to six months or he can have completed it in a day. Don't immediately assume that this is another gimmicky artist. Critics, both in Paris and London, are enthusiastic about his abstract creations. They consider them the culmination of a wealth of experience. Here's an example of his creation which you saw as a pile of scrap metal. Here's another, and if it gives you pleasure, if you like its shape, the boy who went to sea when he was barely a teenager and who ever afterwards dreamed of being an artist has seen the realization of his life's ambition.